Add alternate languages is a great feature when you're working with team members in different countries. So in this snip, we'll see how we can add alternate languages to a SharePoint site once it's been created. And I will also show you how users can change their settings by updating their own user profile so they can see the site in their language, should you choose to make this language available. To add alternate languages, log into your SharePoint site collection and navigate to the gear icon and click on Site Settings. Under Site Administration, you have Language Settings. The default language for this site is English, and this is the language that has been chosen when it was created. And underneath that, you have a list of alternate languages to choose from. And if you scroll down, you even have more languages. For this demo, I'm going to choose French. So I'm going to tick the box but you can choose multiple languages if you want to. Then you scroll down and you click on OK. So now it means that this language is available to your users. So if they have put French in their user profile properties, then they'll be able to enjoy this feature. So now let me show you how a user can change their user settings to see a site in a different language. From a user perspective, you need to click on your profile picture and click on my profile. Now you are redirected to Delve and you can update your profile. We're going to click on update profile. And if I scroll down a little bit, you have how can I manage language and regional settings. Click on this and then click here. This is a link. Click the ellipsis and then language and region. So on the left side, we have language preferences and I have nothing set yet. So it means that I will have a site in the default language. And to add a language, just expand the drop down menu and choose a language. So we're going to choose French and click add. Once finished, just click on save all and close. And it can take up to one hour for the changes to take effect. Click OK. Now your language preferences from a user perspective have been updated. I wasn't going to make you wait for an hour. So I've logged on with a user who had his profile updated already. So I'm simply going to navigate to the site collection and see what's the result. And now you can see that the site is actually in French. Thank you for watching.